This is the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, as you can see. There's a story about that ladder up there. So that ladder, it's not been moved in centuries. There's a big story about that. I'll find the story and I'll post it over on there. Okay, let's have a look. This is it. This. That's the tomb. It's probably normal days with normal wooden wood. I mean, this was all built after. The build is over it. Yeah. The actual rock itself is in there. And that's what people got touched and kissed. And... Uh, that's the tomb. Oh, Jesus? Yeah. Possibly. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Of course. And what I'm saying is, this was all built over it to protect it in this church. And inside there, you can go in into another room and you can touch the rock. Or the rock's where it would have lived. Wow, look at that. That's amazing. Did you see this guy? You can go inside, but you'd have to join the big queue. My problem this is, is it's too grand, it's too, yeah. <clears throat> you know, it seems to go against everything yeah. that Jesus would say. No. Jesus, uh, sell it all, give yeah. it to the poor. No, Jesus, when they came to uh, arrest him, they couldn't recognize him from uh, yeah. was his disciples with Jesus, yeah? He was wearing humble clothes. So 
So my, I hear that two different churches occupy this at the same time. I know if Martin Luther was here, he, he would have ah, he would rallied against it. It's all the superstition and all that kind of thing. Okay, I've had enough. Let's go. I can walk around if you want. Or... No, I have enough. We're going out.